Handy Hudsonite here, and I am here with my AirPods. One of the th things about AirPods, as great of a product as they are, is they're notorious for getting clogged up. You see this small little screen here that covers the speakers that gets clogged with debris, with especially with earwax. And a few days ago, I actually these got so bad I didn't get any sound out of this speaker. I thought these became defective or there was a software glitch. And I'm going to show you how I cleaned this so that I got my sound back right after this. AirPods are very easy to maintain and clean as long as you're consistent in doing it. Sometimes though, for whatever reason, AirPods are going to tend to get clogged up. And this is very common for people who produce a lot of earwax. And what happens is that earwax and other debris clogs up these screens that cover the speakers, especially on this front main speaker that's larger. They get in there. They can also get in here on the side speaker, and they can also affect the ear detection. So what I've done, to clean these out is I just grab a regular q-tip and you can take a dry one to begin with and just gently work it through on the speaker and if they're really bad you'll see a lot of earwax come off on this and then just switch to uh, the other side of the q-tip and continue to work it. If you really want to try to get more of the earwax out you can use hydrogen peroxide you can also use rubbing alcohol and just lightly moisten the tip of the Q-tip, and that will uh, that will enable you to get uh, more of the earwax out, especially the wax that collects around the inner edges of the uh, screen there. Now, what happened to me was mine when I just looked at the screen, it looked clean, but I was getting no sound out of it. I thought it was a software problem maybe even a hardware problem, and I thought, great, my AirPods have gone bad. I've only had these for a few months. But what I did is I did another step in addition to this cleaning technique, is I inhaled and I exhaled. So I, I blew through this and then I, I sucked on this uh, front speaker, and that was enough to dislodge what, whatever was left in there to clear it out enough that I got my sound back. And now. I actually had my wife test these for me to ensure that this speaker wasn't working at first because I thought, well, maybe it's just my ear or I have too much earwax in my ear, but that was not the case. This screen had become uh, clogged up even to the point where it didn't even look like there was anything in it. So if you're experiencing low volume or no volume out of one of these, this is a great technique, very quick, very easy to get your sound back and to get the optimal uh, stereo and, and bass and everything that you desire with AirPods. So I hope this has been helpful for you. Be sure to subscribe to my channel where I give you more tips, hacks, and reviews like this one. And don't forget the notification bell to set that to all notifications so you can get my content as it goes up. And I will see you in the next video.